Hello everyone, this is the day that the Lord has made and we will rejoice and be glad in it. May God give you the treasures of darkness and the hidden riches of secret places that you may know that he is the Lord who has called you by name, the God of Israel. I pray in the mighty name of Jesus that God will open before you the two-leaved gate and it will not be shut. This month, I pray that God will do the impossible in your life in the mighty name of Jesus. God can create something out of nothing. In the Bible, five loaves and two fishes were supernaturally multiplied to feed a multitude. This has been ministering to me lately. Many people get a bi-weekly paycheck that feels like five loaves and two fishes when there are a multitude of things to do with it. But friends, as we believe God, He can stretch our paychecks in diverse ways. I have a personal testimony about this. I once heard a sermon titled The Creative Power of God and it came to me like Rima. I suddenly realized that my God is the creator and that I was created in his image and likeness and that the apple does not fall far from the tree. A lion does not give back to a goat. From that day, I began to design my own outfits. There are many occasions when people will walk up to me and say and tell me how much they love my outfit. And I'm, I think to myself, it's a Maggie original. Seriously, if you reside in my area, chances are what you see me wearing is a Maggie original, one of my creations. Friends, that same God is your God because he's the same yesterday, today, and forever. With him, there is ne neither Jew nor Greek. He is not a respecter of person. He is impartial. He taught Daniel all manner of workmanship. He is the only wise God. He can do the same for you. At a wedding in Cana of Galilee, the wine ran out and Jesus created more wine from water. I pray in the mighty name of Jesus that wherever the wine may have run out in your life, may God perform the miracle he performed at that wedding in Cana of Galilee. May you burst out with new wine in the name of Jesus. May you burst out with new ideas, new concepts, ideas that will take you around the world in the mighty name of Jesus. Psalms 119 verse 18 says, Open thou my eyes that I may behold wondrous things out of thy law. There was a well in front of Hagar, but she didn't see it until God opened her eyes. The Bible tells us Jonathan dipped his stick in the honeycomb and his eyes were enlightened. I pray in the mighty name of Jesus that this month God will show you where the honey of this land is. The secret of the Lord is with them that fear him. He reveals deep and secret things. Friends, you may have been eating on the floor I pray in the mighty name of Jesus that you will begin to eat on the king's table. I pray that God will open your eyes and lead you to that fish that has your financial breakthrough in the mighty name of Jesus. I pray that you will discover the honey of the land where you are. May God open your eyes to see the well of opportunities before you. May you eat the good of the land. May God bring you you honey out of a rock for you. I pray that you will birth nations in the mighty name of Jesus. In Psalm 73 verse 17, 
David said, Until I went to the house of the Lord, did I see the end of my enemies. May you see the end of your enemies. May God give you clarity to break even. David also said he was glad when they said unto me, Let us go into the house of the Lord. As you go into the house of the Lord this month, may God clothe you with the oil of gladness above your fellows. In Jesus' mighty name. Until next time, beloved, I will see you in my next video. Please subscribe to my channel by clicking the subscribe button to your right. Be blessed in Jesus' mighty name.